Hey guys, greetings. I'm just rushing to catch a train. I talked to talk to our people about um, you know the importance of uh, you know electing a, a good leader come 2019. You know I think it's very important because uh, if you look at the way things are going back home, it shouldn't really be the ca that case. And, uh, you know, so basically, it's necessary that we try and endeavor to elect a good leader from 2019 to make a difference. The other thing I want to talk to you is um, I read on the paper about uh, Professor Mogalo, uh, the YPP presidential aspirant. So he went to visit his alma mater, uh, Government College, Umahia. And guess what? He saw that uh, this institution, you know, is instead of a deplorable condition, and the, the, the buildings are kind of very old, it was not refurbished. So it's kind of an eye opener, really, for all of us to know that, you know, the southeast of Nigeria has been totally, you know, in deplorable condition and totally relegated. There's no government present. So it's important and paramount that we elect someone that will look after all of us. You know, so uh, I thought to make this quick video. I'm just rushing to catch my train. So to make this quick video to encourage all of us from 2019 to elect a credible leader. So Professor Mogalo, it's very nice that you visited your alma mater but this has been going on for far too long. You know, uh, we actually need to start raising our voice and raising our awareness. The state of, uh, the state of uh, developmental condition, you know, our place actually is for the world to see. There is a lot of agitation going on in Southern East Nigeria because Things are not going as, as it should be. So it's important that from 2019 that uh, we elect someone that will look after the, um, the citizens, old, young, and everyone, that will have inclusive government, that will have idea that will be beneficial to everyone. So I thought to do this quick video and uh, you know to pray out there that you know we need a good leader and more importantly who will develop a policy that impacts the humanity thank you and remain blessed stay tuned